While the Braves and Cardinals came into tonight's game at two and a half games back in the respected divisions, a little difference in age between Bryant Snitker, the Braves manager, and Oliver Marmol, the Cardinals manager. Bryant Snitker, a, life, a lifer in the Braves organization. Same could be said for Ali, his first year as a manager this season for the Cardinals. Now, before today's game, I caught up with Ali in the coach's locker room to ask him a number of topics about his time playing for the College of Charleston. Now, Ali owes a lot of credit to his former coaches at the college, Scott Foxhall and John Pulaski. Both took a chance on him and taught him a ton to where he is today. Now, I also asked Ali about his impressions of Charleston, what he remembers about the Holy City from his time as a Coug. And it's cool to, to be a part of something that uh, isn't viewed as elite, um, but you can make it that, right? So uh, being an underdog has always been part of of the story uh, for myself and for that school. So being able to be a part of it with the group of guys that we were able to have together there um, and compete and show the rest of the world what we're capable of doing was kind of neat. Now besides Ollie's love affair with the city of Charleston, I also asked him about his favorite memories as a Cougar. He talked about the camaraderie with his teammates. Now one of those teammates when Ollie was a freshman was Brett Gardner. The two of them led the college to the regional and then Ollie went to the super regional at his time with the college. He batted 327 in three years as a Coug. That'll do it now from Atlanta. Reporting from Truist Park, I'm Dan Fanning, News 2 Sports.